Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. How long does it take baking soda to raise pH in pool? Keep the pool water in motion to avoid cloudiness. Step 5. Allow the baking soda to circulate. Depending on the size of your pool, it may take 6 to 10 hours before the water is fully circulated. Step 6. Retest your water and repeat adding baking soda if necessary. Can you put too much baking soda in pool? However, adding too much baking soda might also raise the pH level of your pool to an undesired stage, alkaline. In the case where too much baking soda is added to hard water, it can cause a buildup of calcium around your pool. How much baking soda does it take to raise the pH in a 1000 gallon pool? Add 1 third cup per 500 gallons per decimal point you need to raise the pH. For example, if you have a hot tub that holds 1,000 gallons of water and has a pH of 7.0, you would need 1 minus 1 third C. Baking soda. Make your drinking water slightly alkaline. How much baking soda does it take to raise a gallon of pH? To raise the pH slightly, use 1 teaspoon of baking soda per 5 gallons of water. For example, if you need to raise a pH of 5 to 6 in a 50-gallon aquarium, you need about 10 teaspoons of baking soda. Remove the fish from the aquarium and place them in a holding tank if possible. How often should I add baking soda to my pool? If the pH drops below 7.2 after a day or two, add another 4 pounds. Baking soda per 10,000 gallons of water. The procedure should bring alkalinity into the desirable range of between 100 and 150 parts per million. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. 